everyone, I'm Edita Sitar from Laundry Basket Quilt. Welcome to Quilting Window Live. It's Friday and I am so happy and so excited that you joined me in today to visit with me and see what's new and exciting from Laundry Basket Quilts. I have been so busy with all our girls in the office prepping things up for the holidays and you know I didn't do too many handmade things this year so it's last minute that I'm trying to finish some projects did you watch our quilting corner yes oh I'm so thankful that you did because at our quilting corner I show you a small project and we sew together you get to ask questions that shows happen on Wednesday and this Wednesday I showed you guys how to make a small bag that you can put either your favorite quilting goodies or maybe those quilting goodies that you wanted to share with your friends and you want to gift somebody and just to let you know I have a special gift for you you know on Wednesday I announced we had a big sale on our Coco Blue Fat Quarter Fat 8 layer cakes charm packs jelly rolls uh, fabrics guess what I want to give you a little bit more that sale is extended until Sunday Sunday night done so if you want a cocoa blue you go ahead and visit our website and look at how cute I have packaged my cocoa blue fat quarter fat eight and I add really nice uh, threads to it from our cocoa blue collection the thread set comes in in a small package as well in a large package let me open the large package to show you look at this isn't that nice there are 12 beautiful threads from orophil they're weight 50 those orange spools are so so nice and i chose beautiful blues i accent them with two lights and then really nice warm cocoa you know for cocoa blue so those are those wonderful wonderful threads and if you love them they're on our website you can go ahead and get them there and I put mine with my fabrics because I'm gonna use this as one of my gifts and yes this cute little ornament was made from our canvas panel if you want to learn more about this projects that i'm showing you right now go visit our quilting corner it's going to be on youtube we did it live show but we keep those shows for you so you can go ahead anytime you wanted to learn how to make a bag like this you can go back and visit look at there's a, a bigger one oh isn't that wonderful i put my beautiful beautiful half yard cuts in that one and look at how nicely i can pop this on my shelf display beautifully and then it's easy access i can see it browse through it pull what i need and enjoy enjoy isn't that nice look at how gorgeous this is those are easily made you need a panel and you need a little bit of a lining i use a, a fat quarters or you can get half yards and use those as well in next few weeks i'm gonna show you on a quilting corner how i make this fun bag so we just learned how to make just a basic bag to put our fabrics and now we're going to be adding a little handles to it so that way you can go ahead to the grocery store and be all excited about sharing your quilting journey with everybody and speaking of a bag i love filling up my bag with goodies for christmas and today's show is all about last minute gifts and last minute things that you can uh, get for yourself or you can get for your friends one of my favorite gift is books I love giving books as a gift for the holidays and you could go ahead grab one of our little handful of scrapbook this one is great for a beginner or advanced quilter because there are 32 gorgeous small projects in the beginning you have beautiful antique quilts and yes this is my mom right here on this picture and this is my grandma my mom came from a family of 14 children and she's one of the oldest ones so she's right here in the picture oh, i miss her so much i'm not gonna get to see her for the holidays but my heart always will be with her and look at this 
I have all this cute little quilts in it and this is great like I said for a beginner or advanced quilter to use up the smallest scraps you have those are not miniature quilts they're just small quilts perfect for decorating hanging on a wall gifts so this book you can give a book or you can get ideas what you could make i'm gonna save one of those books for our little contest today yes we're gonna have a contest i'm gonna ask you guys some questions and i'm gonna see if you have paid attention and listen how many quilts is in a uh, little handful of scraps book just kidding that's not the question okay but there are other things that I'm going to be asking you guys. Another wonderful, wonderful book is this Rainbow Scraps. I love this book. So many of you are enjoying it. Grab your scraps, line them up, matching it up, the quilts that I have in the book, and you are going to have a beautiful rainbow just uh, for you in your sewing room. Look at this picture in this book. Isn't that just stunning? yes i have to give a credit to aaron and mary that did a lot of the pictures in this book this is just incredible i love 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 those pictures thank you girls for doing such a good job on the pictures and i hope you guys enjoy the book this is a perfect gift you can get a book you can get a little set of threads with it and you can be ready as a beautiful gift for someone so books are my number one. I'm going to save both of them for your questions. Now, I showed you this fun projects. If you have not watched our show on Wednesday, I showed like a really cute variety of projects from our canvas panel. Right now we have six designs, canvas that we using to print on it. It's a little bit heavier. So when you are sewing, you're going to need a thicker needle. You don't want to break your needle as you're working on the, with those fabrics. It's nice and thick. It uh, has a little bit of a polyester. I love that because no matter what I do to my bag, it's always look beautiful and nice. Did you see it doesn't crinkle? So for like pillows, bags, all these items that you're planning to use quite a bit i think this canvas material would be very very nice and what i'm doing is right now we have six designs those designs are all vintage based designs except the stars upon stars design this one right here this one is a uh, from my quilt that I have made but we have hexagons we have cute blocks we have trip around the world we have more hexagons we have a little log cabin stars so there are so many fun fun designs and you can get a panel from the panel you can make a bag you can make a bag with a handle you can make a pouch you can use it as a placemat cut up and make placemats for your table you can fold it in half and this is what i did i fold it in half took one of michael's socks laid it down outlined it and then stitched it and made a really cute uh stocking right there and i'm gonna fill up my stocking with quilting goodies from myself <coughs> uh, now if you want just something fun and simple notice the pillow this is from the star about upon stars uh uh, panel look how fun and simple all that I did is I did a bag like an envelope bag where I put the pillow right through this little hole remember make sure you stitch those sides so we kind of pose it nicely for you and the shape of it, your pillow looks great so I'm gonna be making one more of those because I wanted two for my couch for the holidays yes i'm making all these fun projects i'm gonna be posting pictures from my house you guys gonna love 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 what i'm doing in the middle of my table i'm doing a table runner from the panels that is gonna be just stunning so those are the projects you can go ahead still quickly make before the holidays we have plenty of the panels you can go ahead go to our website at laundry basket quilts and get the panels but or maybe you want to give a panel as a gift and for example if i were to get a book i would get a panel and wrap my book in the panel put a beautiful string a little branch with it and somebody is getting a book with a fabric wrap around it i like to do this for my quilting friends i always wrap my gifts in fabrics for them so half yards 
uh, all panels wrapping it up look so nice just like this one if i would have just take a fat quarter bundle and give it to somebody or in a paper bag it would not be as charming as i'm giving somebody a cute little bag that they can not only storage the fat quarter bundle but storage other scraps in it for later so it's recyclable and really really fun so we're gonna be talking about a lot of moa small projects from bags to storage to placements to decorating your household with it and you know in no time uh, we are gonna be getting ready for Valentine's and I'm planning to steal your heart uh -uh, with all the cuteness that we're gonna have happening here but speaking of lasting gifts one of my favorite things to give is blocks of the month subscriptions you don't have to sign up yourself you can gift somebody else and they get it every month a beautiful package so it's a gift that keeps on giving for eight months for six months for 12 months so that is a really really fun idea so blocks of the months are nice or maybe a beautiful kit for upcoming quilt alone so if you have this person that loves quilting or you thinking about uh, what i want for christmas uh, um, yourself then maybe you want to tell your husband tell your friends send the message hey this common bride quilt alone is coming up from laundry basket quilts i would love to have a kit and maybe you get a kit for the quilt alone if you do not get a kit treat yourself at least for the pattern come on up middle of february we are doing quilt alone with common bride we're gonna be moving to our new studio in january end of january i'm gonna get to see you guys at the road to california in january then we are moving and then in february we are gonna have the best time ever making one of my most beautiful quilts called common bride and we have kits available on our website those kits are limited amount so if you want one please get one right now because i know when we start you guys are gonna be calling emailing and we're gonna be trying to scramble to get a kit to you but we have them right now so go ahead to our website at laundry basket quilts and get a kit for yourself or maybe for yourself and a friend and then two of you can do this quilt together common bride is gonna take a little bit of work but oh my gosh what a result just stunning so this is upcoming this is what we're gonna be doing next all right so common bride but i mentioned to you that uh, we are doing blocks of the month and blocks of the month subscriptions are very very nice gift fabric club low quilts club block of the month to me this is a gift that it's so easy somebody gets it over and over every single month i'm planning to treat my mom and my mother-in-law both for nice subscription because i know that every month they get a package and they get so excited about it so we are having two blocks of the month we are having three blocks of the month this year three let's start with one of my personal favorite it is the low house um teller shop village this is the blocks this is the quilt this is my practice block i just had some fabrics so your quilt gonna have darker backgrounds and the houses are gonna be light i love that look then your sashings are beautiful solid from our linen texture this is stunning this block of the month is very reasonable already pre-cut every month you get two houses and we're doing this one for 10 months and we're starting this one in january so if you want to go sign for this one even if you're thinking oh i want to do common bride and i want to do another block of the month this one is so simple you're gonna regret if you don't sign why because sometimes it's nice to do something that repeats over and over again and then it's a simple block and in the end you get enough practice that you can say you know what that house block i can do it with my eyes closed so this one is our teller shop village you can sign up right now for this one just go to our website then we have two moa blocks of the month that are coming in yes i have a beautiful reveal for you guys 
first one is gonna be our blizzard quilt yes this one is all made with 60 degree triangles and diamonds and this is all six point stars i have worked on that for a really long time i'm super excited about this project i love snowflakes i have always loved snowflakes and we have another pattern that I released a few years ago for just one block that is very similar to it. And I start building on it. I thought, yeah, you guys gonna love this. Again, this one completely pre-cut. We only gonna offer this one as a pre-cut option at this moment. So um, this one comes out uh, in uh, April. Okay, so this one is April one. Then the one that comes out in march are you ready it is this one this calls sewing basket yes we have a beautiful pieced blocks with a gorgeous accent of applique some of my favorite images my spools that started a whole bunch of spools out there in the quilting industry have been something that i wanted to put it into a medallion quilt i have a little sewing machine we're gonna do a little bit of applique this one like i said will come completely pre-cut for you and this one it is something to look forward to it this one starts in march so so excited guys right now you cannot sign yet for either one of those i'm just showing you the option the only one you can sign for is our uh teller shop uh village so right there if you are interested in either one of those projects they're gonna be listed by next friday okay so by next friday we will have the rest of our blocks of the month listed and you can sign up i just want to give you a heads up on the projects that we're doing in case you choosing you know am i gonna do this or i'm gonna do that am i gonna get involved in a quilt alone or i want a subscription and do a uh, block of the month i would love you to join me for all of the projects because then i can have so much fun with you it keeps you busy but i know you're gonna have to choose and pick but you know it's gonna be a tough choice I think I'm going to be doing both of them no matter what, or at least sign up if I don't do it right away, I uh, get the kits and that way I can do it later because I just want to bring to your attention, none of those will be available as kits. Sometimes in the end of the block of the month, we have a handful of kits that we put on sale, but uh, at this moment, we're so limited in fabric, we're just have enough for the block of the month that we're hoping that you signed up for so if you want it please sign up by the end of next week and speaking of next week on friday i will be announcing all that our blocks of the month are live you can sign but also next friday bring your friend come with your cocoa, hot cocoa be ready for uh, all the questions because we are having the best christmas party live on our live show for you guys that you ever experienced so you must join us this is gonna be epic so i'm getting ready 12 beautiful things remember we did a 12 boxes of christmas and you got all these gorgeous goodies and kits and everything else this time i don't know i don't know you're gonna come up we're gonna do 12 different questions 12 answers and you are gonna be the uh, recipient of all the beautiful gifts that we have ready for you there may be something handmade by me for that event be ready be ready you know how i am maybe a bag come to your way you know how it is filled with quilting goodies wouldn't that be fun i'm brainstorming on it and guess what erin is already all over that she is so excited because she was like those girls and guys are so good to us we're doing a big event on friday so come on join us all right we talk about blocks of the month i don't want to forget about gifts small gifts to fill up the last minute uh you know christmas list one of my favorite for gifts like i said is threads 
Uh, the smaller boxes like English Garden is just beautiful. It matched perfectly with my English Garden collection. The Coco Blue or the Christmas collection are so, so nice. And for example, the Coco Blue threads, the small box or the large box could go great as a like a gift to give to someone with this block of the month. Can you imagine give somebody this and then have an envelope now from now on? in uh, you're gonna start receiving a uh, blocks of the month i think that would be so sweet so you have something to give not you know just envelope so i would do that with the gift of threads sign your you know loved one or yourself for a beautiful block of the month so that is so much fun now the larger boxes like this one from english garden those are brand new on our website i showed you those before they are just wonderful those threads could be great with our common bright quilt because i'm using some english garden fabric and other scraps so this could be a perfect gift for anybody that is joining for our uh, common bright and if you generous you can get them the threads and the kit so they are ready for a quilt alone now if you watching your budget and you just want something small one spool of thread no matter what color you choose would be wonderful as a gift for someone and those are all orofill threads all weight 50 and those are some of my personal favorites for holidays the greens the reds they are just stunning when you sewing with those with anything i love this i call it yucky green it is just so nice if you want to do little quilting stitches with it and have that like a vintage flavor to it i know you expect that i would use the off-white but sometimes i love that little color to it it's unexpected so those are great gifts now i'm gonna treat somebody today i'm gonna have a questions for you guys uh this is one of my favorite kits this holidays the christmas tree kit it's so simple so easy and we made this kit so special for you guys all fabrics are cut ready set go you just need to press them cut your pieces and start sewing those cute little half square triangles i know you can make this in no time and guess what if you don't finish for this holidays you could enjoy the process and that's the gift to try to make it for next year and just be ready sometimes it's not the fabric itself if the process of quilting of sewing is something fun and can you imagine get one of those give it to someone and teach them how to sew and quilt that would be such a good christmas gift yeah with pattern kit and your time and maybe one spool of thread either that light one or that green one for the little later on accent that would be just wonderful now you probably wonder about the quilts behind me i don't want to forget them they're waiting here on a table quilter's cabin one of my personal favorites this one is the antique quilt that i have the pattern is a little smaller than my antique quilt it is just wonderful and we have this available on our website now mistletoe it is timeless i did this quilt a few years ago and every holidays i pull it out the little ohio stars are so fun oh i love this love 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 this quilt so if you want it you can get someone a cute little pattern but if you feel generous we got you because guess what we have a special this week on our noel star kit this is this one and this kit is completely pre-cut for you guys did you ever notice those pre-cut kits look at this completely pre-cut on cute little bags i would recommend getting this as a gift and like i said we have a special on that one if you're looking to get one of the uh, pre-cut kits like noel or montana is also on special let me show you this one you need to use the code noel noel if you just type the code and you get extra 10 percent off on the kit 
uh, and Noel is this beautiful quilt. I have it right here next to me. It's our Noel collection. And when you open it up, you're gonna notice in a box, look at it again, all the blocks, everything beautifully pre-cut pre for you guys, ready, set, go. You just need to find a little bit of time and start stitching and i love giving gifts like this because it's a gift that is gonna keep on giving because it gives you the relaxation the enjoyment of quilting and sewing and enjoying what you really like the most just having some crafty time i love that so the, uh, isn't it great all this wonderful wonderful ideas and gifts so i have three cute little threads from orofil that i think are nice little accent that you can always put it in with anything yes can you give the number on this oh i would love that thank you michael for uh, remembering this 2910 is the green one 2312 is the light um i call it old meal and this one is 22 uh, to 30 is that beautiful red i love this red it's not too bright it's not too hot i really like it but um uh, all three together make a cute little set if you need something for a stocking and i have put few other small things that i thought maybe you wanted um, I love when I'm making baskets like this for my friends. I like to fill it and have like a different different levels to it. So sometimes I pick something bigger, smaller, and stuff that I use it all the time because I know it's gonna come nice and handy. Hot fix is perfect for fusible applique. Then a small three and a half by six and a half creative grids ruler. It's so cute, easy to travel with it. Of course, one of our hand pressing tools is just wonderful and they're made in USA our guy that makes them he is so thankful oh he is so thankful for you guys to buy them because this is how he supports his family he makes those cute little tools and other wooden things and I'm so proud that we're doing this if you want to add a little cute uh, pin cushion it's a magnet on it and also needle sharpener from clover that's always a delicious treat in your stocking and i pulled my um uh, some of my uh favorite pins those are nice and long with the flower heads on it easy to find so those are also from clover and uh, some of you guys were asking about needles to stitch through the canvas and i like to use the tapestry needle the really nice if you want to add some embroidered stitches or you have to sew through it by hand if you want to do like a big stitch on it or a little bit embellishment i would use those and right here i brought it so you see it again our coco blue collection like i said it's on sale right now the code is coco so if you put the code coco you get extra also uh, discount on those beautiful pre-cuts and i just think this is stunning this is gonna be beautiful and i just want to mention to you guys if you signing for our if you want to sign for our blizzard uh block of the month this this one right there this one is made with the coco uh, uh blue collection and what i recommend of course you're gonna get all pre-cut pieces everything in your package just like we do it always i know you love us because we treat you so well and we do such a good job on this but if you want to do extra let's say oh i want to build it up and i want to make moa snowflakes you can go ahead and grab right now uh, fat quarter or fat eight bundle because i don't know by the time the end of the year comes and you finish your block of the month there may be no more of those fabrics and you want to make your quilt uh, larger or do something different with it so it's always nice if it's on special why not grab a little fat eight bundle they are so reasonable so oh maybe layer cakes we have them as well so this is something that i would do i would go ahead get it in my stash some cocoa blue fabric now and then sign up for the block of the month when it starts in april you're gonna be so thankful that you have joined us in for that one um, 
we also have beautiful English garden pre-cuts. I want to bring this to your attention because I know you may be looking for something uh, more traditional and this has been a hot item on our, our website. The um, English garden fabrics are just just beautiful, just beautiful. So simple and there's some pre a printed panels. I'm going to show you those again. They are perfect for borders, jacket, bags, table runners, anything you want to because if you like the cotton feel and you wanted a quilting finish to it, I would be getting those in a yardage so you can get a, a bundle fat quarter, fat eight as your little blocks. But if you want something MOA, you could go ahead and get a pre-printed panel and you know how quickly you can make a table runner if you have something like this already pre-printed. You just get a, a yard of it, fold it in half, sew it around it, flip it inside out, and now you have a gorgeous table runner that has this design on both sides. So you could do that all get a little bit more intense with layering, with backing, bedding, and quilt either on this uh, little lines. This is all pre-printed and it is so, so nice. And I love how it looks with greens. Let me pull this little branch. This is my little uh, branch. Look at how beautiful it looks. And if you add a little Christmas ornament to it, oh, making some Christmas ornaments out of that. Oh, that would be just so nice. So you can go ahead and do that. And we also have hexagons like this. Can you imagine doing your uh, Christmas skirt out of this fabric with all the beautiful hexagons? on it that would be very very elegant really really nice and that sugar plum fairy um, purples that i have in it the plums are just stunning so those are just some of the gifts i have pulled to the front some of our rolling pens because they have been a hot item for the holidays how can you go wrong give somebody a cute rolling pen where you can go ahead and make a cute little cookies look at the designs that there are on it isn't that sweet those little horses oh so charming Oh, if you like more quilting designs, look at how beautiful this looks. Isn't that nice? So we have some of those on our website and you can go ahead, always visit our website at laundrybasketquilts.com and get one of those rolling pens. So your cookie will be extra quilty special. All right. And if you're in a kitchen and you're cooking, you're gonna need two more items you're gonna need a uh, little kitchen towels and you're now familiar with those guys i cannot thank you enough for all the love that you have given to our kitchen towels they are such a cute gift so easy so look at this i can go ahead grab a little threads okay with it then go ahead do a rolling pen and now i have a really fun kind of crossover cooking and stitching Christmas gift. You can mix and match any of those items and oh, getting somebody a kit and then kitchen towel just to fill up the bag a little bit and in case they don't get to make a Christmas tree, you can give them a nice Christmas tree right on the kitchen towel. And that's the same design that I'm going to ask you to answer some questions today. That's right. We also have, I want to bring this to your attention. Uh, um, this is the kitchen towel. We have a bath towels. They're like hand towels. I really like that, especially around holidays. This weekend, I'm finishing um, uh, cleaning, decorating, putting everything up, and I'm putting all my cute little kitchen towels, uh, my um, hand towels in the bathrooms so my little quilting stuff is everywhere but this is gonna decorate my bathroom so so nice so I love that we have them in all different colors the girls brought them closer to me notice that we have it with the little uh, nine patches we have it with the tree on it we have it with amaryllis quilt we have it with baskets there are so many so you have the quilting designs 
but also you have the more traditional designs right here so and i love this one this one is my personal favorite i can't get enough of it i have the star just about everywhere and this is already in my kitchen i'm gonna show you this is the uh, floor mat that you can put it right front of your uh, a sink front of your kitchen uh, stove or you can go ahead put it front of your sewing uh, um, door to your sewing room that way everybody know which room is yours in the house but I really really like that and I have one also in a bathroom so I thought why not front of the sink it's soft it's nice it's easy to use let's see if anybody um, that comes and visit me are going to be so surprised that they have a nice bathroom now with all this beautiful color so matching towels matching uh, uh, a floor mat this is really really nice so we have few of those uh, we don't always have them in stock I apologize for them but I know the guys just finished making some of them and guys all of those items are made here made here we print them so we are so thankful you're providing jobs for our people that are here working in our studios so so thankful i'm not gonna cry i have makeup on but you are the gift every day to me and to our staff and we appreciate you guys so so much yeah so make some cookies get some kitchen towels and think of us when you are sitting with your family around the Christmas tree and enjoying some of the quilted stuff and I know so many of you are making quilts for Christmas and are so excited you are finishing that binding finishing everything because you want to surprise your loved ones and in some way I feel like I'm gonna be a part of that gift because you using our fabrics our patterns and please know we are so so thankful for that so really excited about holidays I always am like this around holidays I'm such a softy but I can't uh, forget if you don't have time to make a quilt but you do want to cover somebody with a lovely blanket we have gorgeous blankets that are printed with this beautiful star design guys those blankets I'm gonna open this one are so soft so delightful look at this isn't that just beautiful oh they're white on this side they're just shiny and beautiful and soft on this one mm, i love 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 those look at how nice and this is a what we call it personal blanket because anybody can have it we have some friends that would say i don't have a baby i want to have this blanket from me listen your blanket you can keep it you can enjoy it and i love it because you can cover your legs as you're watching tv and have a beautiful quilt cool design right in front of you or maybe you have a, a a friend that it's in a nursing home and needs a smaller blanket so those are really really nice i love those i'm so 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 excited about those blankets as one of my gifts this year for um, the holidays i have to make sure my mom gets one too i did not send one yet to her so this is going to be a lovely surprise for her but i sent her all the other stuff but this design not yet yes i have a question yes since, since we're on the topic of gifts yes and i did notice that you showed the lovely english garden uh fabrics i think i saw a gift on our blog today yes did you guys see that gift too oh my gosh guys so all the designers from Endover did a merry maker what it means is each designer give you a gift of beautiful free blog block on their websites you have to go visit the websites download your blogs 
and I was the secret Santa. Yes, so today I posted my blog showing how beautiful those blocks go together. I wrapped them up in a beautiful setting of a star and get this to you guys as a gift on our website, on <coughs> our blog. So please, please go visit our website, click on the links. I have all the other informations for you. If you don't wanna look around, just go to our website, go to our blogs and you'll be able to visit all of those wonderful end of our designers that took a part and create those beautiful blocks for you for free. It's a nice gift. So collect them, have them, enjoy it. And I did my quilt with beautiful English garden fabrics and you can do that too. Or you can use your scraps and do it as well. Oh, guess what? What about some Christmas fabrics? Maybe over the holidays, you would like to do that. What about a cute bundle from Coco Blue and the quilt gets all gorgeous in blue and light. So many ideas. I know all Endover's designers are so thankful for you guys and they share their creativity with you all year long. And I am very thankful that I was the secret Santa to wrap all together and share with you as well. So make sure go to visit our, go visit our website and uh, enjoy that. There are five designers that took a part and make the blocks and I was the secret Santa that wrapped it up in uh, this beautiful uh, layout. Now, um, do you guys have any questions before I ask you a question? We do. We you have, do? Uh, Go we have ahead. a few questions. Um, and I'm going to prepare door prizes for I today. Love that. Um, Susan Smith, um, was Hi, just, Susan. uh, didn't get a chance to catch our Wednesday quilting corner, but she was wondering, she saw that large basket that you held up and she was wondering what size, uh, fabric or how many panels did that take for the basket? This only took one panel and I actually cut my panel to a little smaller. So the panel is 18 inches and I went down to 14 inches. And so I trimmed it from the leftovers. I made a cute little ornaments, not from this one, but you could also do it from this. I did multiple baskets. I'm in the middle of making those because I'm packing all my gifts are going in those with a low branches threads. This is my little gift this year. I want it to be set up that way, but you can trim it down and then you also need a, a fat quarter. Everything that we did is on our quilt and corner. Go see that show. It's going to be amazing. And this one, I had two panels. So look at, I have the star and I have the hexagons. Then I took a half a yard of uh, linen for my lining. Okay. I completely lined the bag. And what I did is I took the panel. I cut a strip of each of the panel and that's what I made my handles from. Notice that this handle is from hexagons. This is from the star. So nothing went to waste and I created a really cute bag. I already had um, one of the girls in the office just loved it. So I quickly went and made another one and gave it to her. So I already have girls and guys that like, oh, this is so cute. I know this is going to be a fun project and we're going to be making those on a next Wednesday live show. So I'm going to show you how I put my handles and how I top stitch around the edge right here to give a good support. So the handle don't come out as you're using your bag. So that is going to be something we're going to be doing through the quilting corner. So come on Wednesdays. It's small, quick projects, or maybe I'm making something. You're just going to be a part of it. Anything that I'm sewing on, you're going to come in and be a part of it and get to see. And if you have any questions or any suggestion, please just email them to our customer service because we're collecting them and that's upcoming shows. So that way we're always doing something that you are interested in it. So now I have a question for you. How many threads is in a big box in, uh, of Aurifil, uh, uh threads? How many thread spools are in the big box? Come on, you know it. I showed you. 
This is a great question. And I did see those when they came in the other day. They are gorgeous. So. Yes. How uh, many spools is inside the big box of Aurifil threads? I right. told you about it. And someone is going to win a Rainbow Scraps book. We We're going to have three questions today. We have a winner. We do already. We do. Yep. That's so I'm just going to pick at random. I feel like that goes a, a little smoother every time so I can I spin the wheel. That. So our winner for this question is Cheryl Phipps. Congratulations, and, Cheryl. And there are 12 spools. That's correct. We have 12 spools. So look at this. It's beautiful. 12 spools right there. This one is the Coco Blue collection. So I do have some lights, but I have also beautiful beautiful blues for you guys so 12 spools and you will be winning our gorgeous book called rainbow scraps so thank you so much please make sure you email us your address to customer service so that way you get the book and of course as usual i will sign the book for you now my question number two and somebody is gonna win the little handful of scraps book can you tell me how many of our printed panels we have on our website how many printed panel designs we have on our website I love this question and yes. so many people we got such great feedback they were just saying like how neat you can just buy a couple of panels and you have a couple of projects to yes make, so. yeah and guys and they're so sweet and what I'm trying to do is with printing the panels give you something that you don't have to quilt they're very strong they're wonderful they're durable and they have a nice little stiffness to it I didn't do anything else to it but just line it and it stays really nice if you want it I will take one apart just so let me do the smaller one so you see it i'm gonna take this one and you can do them any size you wanna but look at this i took my bundle out i'm gonna put it right here all that i did it's low line right there simple bag and what i did this one was one of the first ones i did and i did the corners this way the other ones that i show you everything is hidden inside you cannot see any of the points any on the corners so it's even better than this one that i'm showing you right now so go ahead watch the show and you know i had a big weekend with sewing last weekend i did a dress for my daughter Anna for red carpet event isn't that incredible yes we ran to joanne fabric we got some fabrics and then i made her really pretty dress for the willy wonka red carpet event and i got to go and see her walking down and just glow like a superstar so 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 proud of that girl well we do have a winner we do and, wonderful and i do have to say quite a few people on wednesday's show uh, when you mentioned the dress they did pop in and be like they saw it they I thought it was that. so stunning so oh. kudos to you you did a fantastic thank you. job so. thank you thank you she designed it i just put it together wow. i'm just a you know little um a uh, little person that stitch i she does all of the design she's like mom you have to do this i want you to do that <laughs> she has a vision and i just try to bring it to life and you know when anna and my daughter dolphina were little i always made their dresses and try to dress them and then try to do the prom dresses for them and then eventually kind of like oh we want the bought dress and now it's such a joy because the girls are coming back and they're like mom can you make this jacket for me can you make this dress for me so i don't want to spoil a surprise but i'm making i may be making a quilted jacket for my daughter dolphina i don't think she's watching the show so um but she's gonna be so surprised so so surprised so uh I'm really excited for her. Super special. Who answered the question we for us? We do have a winner, and she must have already checked our website or bought them all. <laughs> I love and, that. And uh, our winner is Tina Little. And Hi, Tina. And there are six different panels. Yes, that's correct. We have six different panels, and you can sh see all of the designs on our website. 
choose your favorite and start making your fun project if it's a pouch if it's a bag if it's a, a pillow you're gonna have so much fun with it and you are going tina you are winning a book called little handful of scraps with 32 beautiful projects that you can enjoy it and again make sure you email us your address so that way we can ship the book to you and i can sign but last questions for you guys is um what um what is the code that you put in to get an extra discount on our pre-cut kits okay i uh, let's see if you remember and i just want to show you one more time so this one will start in april this is our blizzard um uh, quilt we'll be making those beautiful snowflakes and no Y seam for this this is all all straight sewing 60 degree uh, uh, angle and there's uh, all different 60 degree triangles and diamonds this is gonna be so much fun okay now second project that we're gonna have another block of the month is the sewing basket this is the first time today that we're showing this design we kept it a secret because we wanted you guys to have a little something special and this one is just so sweet sewing basket i love this i love the little heart on a basket it's full with scissors and threads and temple so all different cute things and did you see that purple sewing machine that little featherweight I'm gonna shout out to our friends at Featherweight Shop. They're so nice. And this is the one that I am so excited about it because it's the same block over and over again. Please make sure if you wanna sign for this one, this one starts in January. So you need to please sign it up as soon as you can. This one is incredible. This one is the um, Teller Shop Village. So we have three gorgeous blocks of the month that you can choose and pick from really fun i'm so so excited and i also want to tell you that next week we're gonna announce on friday the dates for our retreat okay our mm -hmm. retreat so we do a yearly retreat in a in a hotel we have still secure that location we went back and forth with should we start a retreat in our new space yes we're gonna have some events there but we're keeping our regular retreat because you guys have requested we do not want to change that because so many of you have made friends we want you to be able to come back and stay in that space and enjoy it in our new space we're gonna have day retreats we're not gonna have an overnight retreat so we're gonna have just day retreats day events where you come quilt so have fun with me more of that later on in a year we're going through lots of remodeling lots of getting ready for you guys we're moving in january what it's going to be huge but i want the space to be perfect for you and things are taking a little bit more time than i wanted to it's not as easy you know with remodel so we just want to make sure that you still get uh, together this year for our regular retreat more about this next friday so remember we're having a party next friday we're announcing block of the month that you can start sign up for it and about our retreat there's so many cool things happen now who answer our question and it's the winner of beautiful christmas tree uh pattern and beautiful christmas tree kit oh well i am sure she is going to be so excited to receive yes. that and our winner is marianne hanley and then, marianne congratulations and I, her answer was noel yes the code to get extra discount on our pre-cut kits and it's the montana kit and the noel star kit let me show you that one again so both of those kits right now are on special just type the code noel and you get an extra discount so go ahead go to our website enjoy 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 and i'm gonna be shipping this cute kit uh, to you so you can enjoy it as well and i hope uh, you have fun making that one with someone all by yourself just quiet time sometimes that's good too so don't don't be upset if you have to do it on your own 
now do we have any other questions for today um you know what we uh, we have one more question but i also wanted to just give you um a little a note from Lori. she just Hi, said Lori. thank you for the little extra treats in the fabric of the month club she just says that they are always so very sweet and she appreciates them a lot so. thank you so much so guys our fabric club started as just fabric club and that's the core we sometimes can add a little gift in it i don't know if we'll be able to do that every single month uh, for next year you know fabric prices goes up labor went up all this other stuff but we're gonna try our best to get creative and still treat our fabric club customers with the most fun most respect and uh, get you as much as we can but the fabric club is uh, something I love for you to sign up. It is such a good value. You get 12 fat quarters for $39.95. That is just amazing. And thank you for saying thank you. Yeah. My pleasure. We always think of you guys to take it on to another level and treat you with something fun and special. And this month, what we did, you got a, a, a code to download a PDF from our website and uh, this month uh, you receive from us a beautiful heart template because you have stalled my heart guys this year has been one of our most incredible years with our customers communicating back and forth what you want and you are so excited about all the projects that i put in front of you so i'm very very thankful and fulfilled as a quilter as a designer that you have embraced and loved everything that i have designed and put out there and i can't wait to do some houses with you sign up for this one please this is a great block of the month then if you want it there are two more in the horizon choose a blizzard or sewing basket or maybe both so we will have more information about those blocks of the month for you and just sign up for our newsletter if you want to be notified thank you and and also just for those wondering um you know since we do have so many different clubs that you can be involved in i'll go ahead and i'll drop that link for all of our subscriptions so if you want you can click the link in there and check all about and see what's all involved in them but that sounds wonderful erin um, always thinks of everything oh. i just love working with her erin oh. you know when the show starts <laughs> Erin does the heart for me so I know it's a cue I can start uh, visiting with you guys and talking to you so to Erin back uh -oh. thank you so much and to all of you guys yeah. thank you so much and I can't wait for our Christmas party show next week I'm telling you tune in bring your friends because the more the merrier and if you can share our shows give us thumbs up share our shows with our leave, leave us comments even just to tell us that you like the show we appreciate that the engagement that you do with us means the world to us and we do read through all the comments and we respond to most of them our customer service and myself we do all that we can but always always love hearing from you guys and thank you so much have a wonderful weekend i hope you get some time to quilt and sew and finish some christmas gifts for the loved ones in your life